trying to link up, cutting inside well there. Number 11, uh, Tom McGlinchey it was, uh, uh, cutting in from the right hand side, and again a chance here. Coble inside the Chesterfield penalty area, and it's over the line, and it's in the back of the net from Chambers. Coleman didn't make it, and Ashley Chambers puts the ball in the back of the net. In the 11th minute of the game, it's Chesterfield nil, Colville Town one. Down that right hand side they came, the ball into the penalty area, and the low ball across the six yard box. Colville didn't get there, Chambers certainly did, and Colville Town have the lead. Colville have left one up. That's uh, Luke Shaw, everybody else back defending as the uh, free kick comes in there from Banks. And the header, oh, and he's gone straight into the back of the net. There's no flag from the linesman either. And there's not much celebration about it either. But uh, Chesterfield have leveled, it seems. Wilson to Eggleston and now Alex Dean the right back plays it down that right hand side chasing after it now McGlinchey the cross comes in headed away by Maguire followed up nicely for a second goal and I think that's is that McGlinchey they got that one I think it is and Colwell are back in front the ball played down the right there the cross coming in and just when it looked like Chesterfield were about to clear their lines it was smacked home by I think it was number 11 Tom McGlinchey there oh. Billy Key with him all the way and back to his attempt at the ball forward there strikes Chastley Chambers and Chambers now on the attack again here in by McGlinchey, Chambers to finish and Ashley Chambers does finish six minutes into the second half Ashley Chambers gets his second goal of the game and Cobble Town took a 3-1 lead delight to the Colville fans down to our right here and Ash Chambers gets his second goal of the night